I don't even know if I'm pronouncing it right. Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton. How the hell do you pronounce it? Who cares, right? I have one, okay? Mama, mama, I made it. I made it. Okay, let's get into it. Today I am going to be doing an unboxing video and by the title and what you can clearly see here it's going to I'm going to be unboxing my first designer bag um, it's a Louis Vuitton and I'm so excited about having this handbag um, my boyfriend actually purchased this bag for me and I had no idea I knew he was going to buy me a handbag but I didn't know it was going to be this bag in particular so a little like short story time. So I was at work and um, I was actually on my lunch break and I'm like sitting in my lunch break eating this like garlicky, oniony pizza and my coworker runs back into the break room and she's like, you have to come out here. You have a huge gift. And I'm like, what are you talking about, girl? Like, what are you talking about right now? And she's like, you have to come here. And I'm like, are you serious? Like, I'm in the middle of eating my pizza. I'm being interrupted. Is it a client that's here to see me? What? So she's like, no, girl, come on out. So I immediately goes out and I'm greeted by this huge bouquet of flowers, which I'm going to insert a picture so you can see the beautiful bouquet of roses. So um, I immediately I see the roses and I'm like thinking to myself oh my god am I being pranked or do I have a secret admirer or like who would have sent these roses because it's not uncommon that I have clients that actually send me flowers like I have received a bouquet of flowers before from a client that I've never even met and she's like thank you for helping me with my travel plans or whatever and which is all good um, you know I can accept things at my job that are under like $20 in value. But when I immediately saw these flowers, I knew that they were way more than $20. So then I started thinking like, oh my God, like did my boyfriend just send me this, these flowers or do I have a secret admirer? And then, so the gentleman who dropped them off because the flowers were so vast that he had to use both of his hands to carry them into my office. And, um, the gentleman who delivered the flowers comes back into the store with this Louis Vuitton bag with the bag and I'm like oh my god I know exactly who this is from this is from my boyfriend <laughs> something like this was just so special and I really really am grateful for him and I'm really grateful for this and I really love him and I love him even more for what he put in this card so um if baby if you're watching this I love you so let's get into um, the Louis Vuitton unboxing because this is what you came here to see, right? This is what you guys came here to see. So let's get into it. So as you can see, it comes in this super like dark orangey bag with these like royal blue straps. I'm just totally in love with the bag itself. I want to keep this bag, okay? This is a very, very beautiful bag, very quality friendly bag. Don't ask me the price of this bag. You probably, you guys can probably go into Louis Vuitton's website and figure that out for yourself. But, um, yeah. Let's just get into this, shall we? So, you open up the box. Well, you actually pull this out of the bag, and it's a box. Um, the box is beautifully wrapped. Let's go ahead and move that there. So, of course, I did already open this because I want to see what bag he got me, but um, I'm gonna do this unboxing with you guys. So the box is so big, I was kind of like confused, like what the heck type of bag did he get me? Like, what? Um, so I guess when Louis Vuitton does their packaging, they wrap their um, boxes in like this blue ribbon and it has like the orange words that says Louis Vuitton on it. Um, I don't even know if I'm pronouncing it right. Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton. 
How the hell do you pronounce it? Who cares, right? I have one, okay? Mama, mama, I made it. I made it. Okay, let's get into it. So, um, just pulling the ribbons apart. Here we go. Okay. And we're going to just do something like this. And here we go. We're almost there, guys. I promise. So, um... Louis Vuitton also packaged their bags in a beautiful dust bag that also says Louis Vuitton. I'm sure Babe has like the receipt paper information and um, like the legit papers and everything like that too. Um, I'm sure he kept that because why would you give someone a gift with like um, the receipt and stuff like that? But I'm sure he has that stuff. Um, but yeah, so here's the dust bag. You guys can see this. It's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. My first one. And when you open the dust bag. Here we go. I have a Louis Vuitton Never Full MM bag. And I think this is the most perfect, most beautiful bag ever um to me it's not an everyday bag because um an everyday bag for me is like a little crossbody bag and that's what i thought he was going to get me a little crossbody bag um but this bag to me i'm going to use it more so when i travel um to put like carry-on stuff and my macbook can probably fit in here and um like papers when i'm out running errands and things like that so it's not really like an everyday bag to me. Um, it is going to be more so like a luggage bag. So that's perfect because I don't really have to wear it that much. But it is the monogrammed classic LV bag. It's so beautiful. You can feel the quality. Like I've actually purchased knockoff before. <laughs> I can't believe I'm mentioning this. But I've, I've actually purchased knockoff from Canal Street in New York City. And I know what knockoff feels like, and it does not feel like this. This bag is so beautiful, you guys. Um, when you open it up in the inside, it does have a little wristlet. So even when I'm out, like let's just say if I do want to carry designer, um, this portion, I can. And I just can put the little wristlet part on just to go run some like quick errands or if I want to wear out without wearing the entire bag, which I definitely plan to do. And this bag is very, very deep. I was also looking at ordering um, like a little a handbag organizer because I like to be organized. And especially with a big bag like this, and especially since it's open, that's why it's not realistic to me because it doesn't have a zipper. But you, when you see inside, it does have a little zipper where you can put like your, your wallet and your phone. But I like things with like a top zipper like this. So I actually, I really, really will find myself using the wristlet a lot more than I will be using this bag besides when we travel together and, um, you know, things like that. But yeah, my everyday bags actually have zippers that go across for safety because I'm like, I'm really, really rough. Like I bend over a lot to pick things up, tie my shoes. I don't want anything falling out. So like I was saying, I'm going to get um, a bag organizer to kind of just like make the bag a little bit more structured and to keep me organized when I am on the go and running my errands because I don't like just like throwing stuff in my bag and just like rumbling through my bag like where's my keys, where's this, where's that. Um, so I've been looking at Etsy and they do have like, you know, the bag organizers that you can actually put into the Louis Vuitton bag to, um, you know, so that way you can reduce the clutter because, you know, I'm a Virgo, I don't like clutter. So, yeah. But this is the bag that I got and I'm so, 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 so grateful for my boyfriend. It's my first designer bag. It's a Louis Vuitton and I just love him so much more for this and I'm so grateful. So thank you, baby, once again for my bag and thank you guys for watching. Um, I'll let you guys know how this bag, you know, hangs up or, you know, because I am going to be going on a trip really, really soon. I'm going on a cruise. So I will let you guys know how this bag is actually holding up for me um, since I am going to be doing some traveling and things like that. But yes, I'm so excited. I have the, my first designer bag and 
it smells so good it just smells amazing and it feels amazing so definitely luxury this just makes me want to be like yeah i'm never going to back to your little cheap h&m all the bag even though nothing wrong with those bags because i do carry those bags but it's like dang girl yeah so yeah thank you guys so much for watching my video and remember to uh, like this video thumbs up the video and make sure you share it with other people too so if you guys have any questions leave the questions below in the comment section and i would love to answer them for you guys but other than that thank you for watching my unboxing video and i will chat with you all later peace Mwah.